Hey, this is Ben with Pro Sound TV coming at you at the NAM 2010 show. I have another exotic user here, Mike Campis. Hey, Mike, thanks for coming out, buddy. Oh, no problem, man. It's a pleasure, man. I love this company. You guys are awesome. Well, I know that you got a lot of stuff going on. Uh, we did want to highlight in uh, the February issue of Guitar Player, which, as we were just discussing, uh, we're still in January, but this is actually old news now. It's, fe well, it's February issue. Well, here is your new yeah, full like two-page uh, <laughs> lesson in here. So if you want to learn how to shred a little bit, please go ahead and check out Mike's uh, article here in the February issue of Guitar Player Magazine. Yeah, I do this, I do this all the time, these guys. These guys uh, hook me up every few months. Yeah. So be, make sure you check it out because uh, I've been doing this. And I also Guitar World occasionally, but and also Premier Guitar every yeah. month. Cool. Well, as Mike pointed out, if you could look down below in the picture here, the actual BB is there. Yeah, it's so. Uh, I was going to try to wear it as a necklace, but it was just too heavy to work out. <laughs> hey, Mike, I, I know you've been an avid uh, user of the BB pedal. You're playing boogie amps. Uh, what is it about the BB that you that you like? Uh, the BB, it, it adds no color to the amplifier. It's totally transparent. And it adds, uh, makes the amp more smoother sounding, especially if you're doing more shred kind of stuff. Yep. It, it makes it smooth, and it doesn't color, so like it doesn't... It sounds like the rectifier, just puts more, more to it. So you just get a little bit more push out of the amp. Oh yeah, it gives it more like a little more boost, basically, to it. Well, cool. But it's it's been one of my favorite pedals, and uh, you know, again, we really appreciate you uh, playing that pedal uh, for us. I'm so glad I got that. I mean, um, before I never like I, I never liked distortion pedals because it colors the amp. Like I had pedals that you push it, the amp gets thin. Yeah. Th this pedal, it's still got the bottom to it. It adds a little more gain, and it's like it's awesome. I don't know how how'd you guys do that. I, it's just magic, man. It's all magic. I can't believe it. <laughs> it's like awesome. You know what I mean? Cool. That's, I mean, that's, it's, RC Boost is the same thing. It's like, that thing is crazy. I mean, I have a rectifier preamp. Yeah. And it just like, that thing needs more like sustain to it a little bit. And I put that in front of it and it's awesome. Well, we, we appreciate that. No problem. I appreciate you guys looking me up and uh, absolutely, absolutely. having it available for us to check oh. out. You have a new uh, um, uh, CD coming out here pretty soon. I know that's been on there. Yeah. Uh, when do you plan on it being released and where can people go get it or find out more about you? Um, if you visit MikeCampBeast.com, uh, it's really, at the end of the month, it's releasing um, at the end of January, beginning of February, it's going to be released. If you visit the website, I'll have news exactly what day to be out. And what, what's the name of the, of the CD? Electric City. Electric City. Yeah. Okay, You'll cool. be hearing exotic stuff on that uh, CD. And, and Mike does a few Christmas records as well, so you could get those in, for the holiday season next time. Yeah, so. yeah. I, I, have Chris, I, have, I have my seven CD right now. Cool, cool. Seven CDs, and yeah, check it out on the website. And, cool. Yeah. Well, MikeCampBeast.com, uh, this has been with Pro Sound TV. Mike, hey, thanks for being part oh, of the no family problem, and coming out and hanging with us. And, no problem, man. It's hey, fun. we'll see you on the road. Definitely.